So here we have the Ford Transit Custom Minibus on a 71 plate. I'm going to start off by showing you in the rear of the vehicle and then we'll hop in and run through some controls from there. So this is the view through the sliding door uh, on the uh, driver's side. We have a sliding door on the other side as well. As you can see, there are six seats in the back here and three up front, so nine seats in total. Okay, now that we're inside the minibus, we're gonna start with the dials on the left-hand side. We have the rev counter and on the right hand side the speedometer in the middle at the bottom we have the fuel gauge and coolant temperature gauge beneath that it will show you what gear this car is in it's an automatic so we're in park at the moment above that you can see the total miles which are 9720 and then we have a digital readout for the speedometer being displayed you can change the information displayed there by using uh, buttons on the steering wheel which are just here Beneath that, we have stereo and phone controls. Stereo controls continue on the left, along with cruise control and speed limiter. Over in the center, we then have the touch screen for the vehicle as well. So you can go back to the home screen from here. Uh, you can see uh, audio wise, uh, or music wise, we have AM, FM, and DAB radio. Bluetooth audio as well. This vehicle's also got two separate USB inputs, so you can plug devices into those should you wish to. We can go back again to the home screen, and this is where you add your phone. Search for your vehicle on your device and select it once it is found. And just follow the instructions on screen from there. Working our way down, we have the gear lever for the fully automatic gearbox. The buttons on the side of the uh, gear lever just here will enable you to change up and down a gear manually should you wish to. Directly above that, we then have the air conditioning. So you can adjust the fan speed, the temperature, and the direction the air is being distributed in. The air conditioning is on at the minute, so off. Back on again, we have a heated driver's seat with three different heat settings and the same over on the passenger side, a rear heated screen and a heated front screen as well. Beneath that, you can see the USB input and a 12 volt charging socket as well. All that leaves me to say is thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you'd like to come and see the van in person and have a test drive, please feel free to call us here at MJA Car Sales. We'd love to hear from you soon.